What's your name? Lucifer. Exactly. There are a lot of crime dramas out in the world right now. Some are better than others, but the real question is, which ones are the best? According to Ranker, these are the top 10 must-watch crime drama TV shows. And no, just because it's a crime to watch the Kardashians, it doesn't automatically make it a contender for this list. Let's start with number 10, Columbo. So let's begin with the golden oldie, Columbo. The show aired in 1968 and ran for 10 seasons. Each episode would be around two hours long. It would show the murder at the beginning of every episode, and the audience would then know who the killer is. Then the viewers will follow Lieutenant Columbo, who was played by the talented Peter Falk, as he tries to solve the case. The main reason Columbo was so good is because of the titular character Columbo. His disheveled manner would catch suspects off guard, and this led to him uncovering many of their secrets. Now, we've had a few great shows before and after Columbo, but this is one of the best crime dramas we've ever seen, and if you haven't watched this timeless classic, you have to add it to your list. Next, let's take a look at number 9, NCIS. Now, you're either a fan of NCIS or you're not. Diehard fans will go to war for this series, and others might find it a tad boring, but even if you're not a fan of the show, you have to admit that the show been around for a while, and that it is a great success. The Naval Criminal Investigative Service, yes, the NCIS, focuses mainly on solving Navy and Marine crimes. Now, this show has a few spin-offs of its own, NCIS Los Angeles and NCIS New Orleans, and with the original having 20 seasons so far with another on the way, it's no wonder that the spin-offs are a hit. Abby Shiuto, forensic specialist, and team leader Gibbs are just two of the characters that fans love, as both are charismatic characters that have captured the hearts of fans. If you want to watch this amazing series, you'll have to have a Netflix account. You can also watch it on Amazon Prime if Netflix isn't your thing. Now let's get into number 8, Bones. Bones is one of my all-time favorite crime dramas with a hint of comedy sprinkled in. Now the show follows forensic anthropologist Dr. Temperance Bones Brennan and FBI special agent Seeley Booth as they try to solve murders. Now with the special power of added comedy, the show feels less tense and has a few funny moments that viewers might enjoy. If you're into a few grotesque scenes, with a splash of comedy, this is a must-watch. Most fans like the series because of the relationship that Booth and Bones have. They bicker, they grow, and ultimately they evolve throughout the show. The lighthearted nature of the show has brought in many different types of viewers. If you want to watch the 12 seasons of Bones, you'll need an Amazon Prime or Hulu subscription. On to the next one, number 7, Law & Order. Law & Order was the first of its kind. It followed a group of detectives and the district attorney's office. They showed the capture and sentencing of the criminal, and this is what makes Law & Order stand out from the rest. The show premiered in 1990 and lasted for 20 seasons. But if you want more Law & Order action, you can watch the magnificent spin-off series Law & Order Special Victims Unit. This series has entertained us for years now. It has emotional and gripping stories that can't be found anywhere else. Well, except for Grey's Anatomy, but that's for another list. Law & Order's unique formula left fans captivated and eagerly waiting for another episode or season. This binge-worthy show was cancelled in 2010, but in February 2022, we got season 21. And as of right now, we're waiting for season 22's ninth episode, The System, to air on the 8th of December. Next, we're at number 6, Breaking Bad. I'm just as disappointed as you are. Breaking Bad is one of the best shows to have ever been made, and not to see it in the top 5 is blasphemous. In this show, we see high school chemistry teacher Walter White and former learner Jesse Pinkman as they create methamphetamine. Walter went from an average suburban father to one of the biggest drug lords. The former Malcolm in the Middle actor Brian Cranston and Aaron Paul went straight into the acting hall of fame with this series. From cinematography to visuals, everything is absolutely stunning, but the real hook was the story. Each character was very fleshed out, and with a captivating narrative, you wouldn't want to turn off your TV. The bond between Jesse and Heisenberg was brilliant, and the two really worked well together. The feeling of suspense was something out of this world, and it was unmatched at the time. This show changed the way episodic television is made. If you want more Breaking Bad action, you have to watch Better Call Saul and El Camino. Both were amazing to watch, but nothing will ever beat Breaking Bad. Let's get into number 5, The Mentalist. Stucker, he saw you here, probably smirked and said something very clever, made you feel small. <laughs> Humiliated you. <laughs> The Mentalist takes a massive turn when it comes to crime dramas. Here we follow the former psychic and con man, Patrick Jane, who is played by the brilliant Simon Baker. He's an independent consultant for the California Bureau of Investigation, and we see him use his brilliant observational skills to assist in the solving of crimes. He immediately became a fan favorite when viewers realized he was searching for the murderer of his wife and daughter. This show is known for its episodic nature, and the progression of viewers sees throughout the season is something spectacular. This show is a must-watch for any crime drama fan. Now on to number four, Law and Order Special Victims Unit. Traitor! <laughs> Court 
Law & Order SVU has been around since 1999 and is the longest running show to date. And yes, we're still seeing new episodes being released. This New York-based show follows the Special Victims Unit in its investigations against sexually related crimes and brings the perpetrators to justice. Now the show has been airing for many years, but it manages to keep itself new and up to date. We've seen some of the best characters in the show, like Olivia Benson, who's portrayed by Mariska Hargitay. She captured the hearts of many fans and has done one amazing job in the show. Let's go on to number three, Criminal Minds. Try again. Fail again. Fail better. Samuel Beckett. Criminal Minds is a great series. It shows the story of the FBI's behavioral analysis unit and how they solve some of the most grotesque murders. We've seen 15 seasons of Criminal Minds and more are to come, especially after the backlash it received from fans when it announced the last season in 2020. Criminal Minds is a captivating show that will keep viewers intrigued and constantly engaged. You should really watch Criminal Minds if you haven't already. are you doing? Now we're at number two, Sherlock. Sherlock Holmes is a name that is known in many different households, and Benedict Cumberbatch did a brilliant job portraying this character in the BBC series. This self-proclaimed high-functioning sociopath adaption was the right call as Cumberbatch keeps the character fun and likable, and this modern take on the beloved character is a welcomed idea. The series is met with praise from critics and fans alike. This series originated on UK TV, but soon got attention from fans around the world. Sadly, the show only had four seasons, but it was four impactful ones. You have to add this show to your list if you're a crime drama fanatic. <laughs> and finally, the number one spot goes to Hellbound. Hellbound is a newer series that came out on Netflix in 2021. It was directed by Yong Sang Ho, who is also the director of the great Train to Busan film. This series follows the lives of people who have committed sins, and they're now being dragged to hell by some supernatural force. This show was received very well, and fans all around the world loved it. Now, personally, I would have given the number one spot to Breaking Bad, but Hellbound is a great choice as well. Now, this show isn't like the others on the list. It has a supernatural twist, but at its core, it's still a crime drama series. The show follows a detective who wants to solve the mystery and bring justice to those who do wrong. He's like Batman, but not as wealthy. We've heard a few rumors about a second season, but that's still only speculation. But either way, fans all around the world enjoyed the show, and if we see another season, we won't say no. Now, an honorable mention. Just leave her out of it, huh? Too late. Sons of Anarchy would have been great for this list as well, but sadly the story of Jax Hexler wasn't a part of the ranker list. Although if you're a fan of Charlie Hunnam and want an action-filled crime drama, this is a show you'd have to watch. Sadly, here is where our video will have to end. If you enjoyed it, let us know in the comment. Tell us your favorite show on the list and what your favorite show of all time is. Remember to like and subscribe for more content like this. See ya!